She's dying. Naked. I love when she's naked. Look at that. Mm, but don't hurt his pretty face. Okay, Miss Britney bitch. Absolutely not. I mean, absolutely. Oh, that's really zoomed in. Let's just zoom you out a minute. <sighs> okay, I do feel like over here is darker, but I have a window there, so you know what? I can't fucking do, uh, do anything about it. I've shut my curtain. So I guess I'm gonna do this. <sighs> Hi! I've got a chewing gum in. Should I swallow it? Hi! Welcome back to another video. So, today we are doing part two to a series that I started I think around two months ago now or something. This is where I just kind of go through every single Britney Spears music video she has ever released. In today's video we are doing six new music videos and they are Every Time, Womanizer, Circus, If You See Kami, Break the Ice Until the World Ends. So, I think I might have seen every time. This is gonna be fun, I'm very excited. I've got them all loaded up on my laptop in front of me, so it, it should run pretty smoothly. You'd like to fucking think so, wouldn't you? If you're excited to see my thoughts to these music videos, please do keep... If you're excited to see my thoughts to these music, music videos... Why am I really problematic today? If you're excited to see my thoughts to these music videos, please do stick around and keep on watching. If you enjoyed this video, please do like, comment, subscribe. I'd love to have you here. Turn on those post notifications because I can see who's done it and who hasn't and it's crazy. Check me out on Instagram and Twitter to be on the screen up there as well as link down below. And yeah, let's get into it. Woohoo! Okay, so the first one we're going to be doing is Every Time. It's four minutes, eight seconds. Let's just get into it. It is a fucking banger. See, I don't remember this being the start of it. It just tells us that. Absolutely not. Okay. Kick his ass. Wait, we're actually getting like tea. Oh my god. Wait, why are we getting fucking tea? I did not know. We'd be getting tea. Mmm. So we've already had, literally in the first minute, jabs at the uh, paparazzi who we all know how I feel, right? Fucking hate them, dickheads. And we've had the tabloids as well. Also, he was way ahead of the trends. Look at him and his fucking Jordans. Absolutely. Let's continue. I'm loving this. Oh, at least he's sticking up for her now. Oh, she's angry. Oh, everyone's angry. I swear this was the one with her on the cliff. This is the one that I always got mixed up with, um, I'm not a girl, not yet a woman. I haven't seen this video at all. Right, so I haven't seen this. I was expecting, I was thinking like, when are we gonna get onto this cliff then? <laughs> it's not that big. Okay, I'm sorry for pausing so much, we're literally only halfway, but one, he's very sexy, two, I know it's toxic, but he is really sexy, but yeah, guys, I'm loving this, come on, story, hmm, who's this about? Look at him, hello, sir. Wait, what? Wait, is she fucking dying? Wait, how did we get here? She's dying. Was this when someone ragged at her? But she's not gonna die from that. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, he's found her in the bath. Oh, bleh. He didn't have to get in the full bath, did he? Could've just... Oh, he's almost fucking mounting her, Jesus. I'm sorry, guys, that seemed a bit, um... Pointless. He had to, like, he didn't have to get all the way in, and he was like fully crotching her face. Jesus, calm down, fella. We get it, it's Britney. Woof. I'm missing so much, I already know I am. Like, who's that meant to symbolize? We were so close to getting some nipple then. <gasps> Wait. 
Was that all a dream? I don't know. Guys, this is kind of confused me. This has got me thinking, though. Like, at the end there, we already saw him, like, pull her out. But she's just got herself out. So was it meant to be a dream? Do you know what? I'm kind of confused. You guys are going to have to let me know what I missed, because I'm sure I missed a lot in that video. But I'm liking how we had story. I didn't expect to get story. Why do I never expect to get story? Oh. Anyway, guys, great music video. Got me thinking. Great start. Ooh, okay, I like that one. Let's move on. Next one, let's keep these good times flowing. The next one is Womanizer, the director's cut. Now, I obviously saw snippets in that for the record thing that I did, but other than that, not seen it, I don't think. So let's just go. I'm expecting choreography doing this one from what I saw in, in the documentary. So I think this one's gonna be a good one. Ooh, Britney motherfucking Spears. Naked, I love when she's naked. Look at that. <laughs> I don't care if the music video is wank, to be honest. I I'm having a great time. I love the song. But looks like we're getting budget. Like, look at this little setup. Also, sexy, sexy man. I'm so lonely. I'm so alone. What was that meant to be? It it's held on a date then. That probably symbolised something around this time for like a release or something, maybe, did it? Hello, sir. Yeah, bitch, get him told. This was great! We've got a story still, but we've got a fucking choreography. Guys, I bum when she does choreography. Obviously, I'm sure we all do. Also, the, the guy is really doing it for me. And it's kind of nice that I already have seen, like, kind of how they made it. I love the naked spa scenes, too. Oh, he's... Did you see that? He fully served to the camera, then he was like... I wonder where he's at now. I wonder what he's doing with his life. Okay, sir. Oh, photocopy the ass. Everything. <laughs> I'm gonna pause. Okay, I will say Redwig, absolutely. Right? First and foremost, Redwig. Red, red, Redwig, absolutely. Um, also, yeah, the preface for this music video was that she was gonna be all, playing all these different girls, wasn't she? And he was being like, Saucy towards them all. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come on, wind machine. We've got an orgy going on. Oh, he's excited. <laughs> Do you know what it is? It's the bum chin. Right? It is the bum chin. I love a bum chin. And he, oh, God, he really do, is, yeah, he's serving it. <laughs> Don't get him in the fucking shower, I can't handle that. Was that a Tesla? Oh, she's fucking him up, she do be fucking him up. Oh, she's fucking him up. Okay. Mm, but don't hurt his pretty face. <laughs> the way she just went, boing, dead, dead. I loved it. That was a great music video. We had story still, we had choreography. Oh, I loved it. And that story made, made a bit more sense than every time. I can't lie, every time kind of got me confused as to what was reality, what wasn't, right? But Womanizer, sexy, sexy man. But she also fucked him up. She uh, played the strong woman, so I'm into that. They did some really fun things in that one too, like um, really cool transitions, really cool special effects, really, like, just, they really played around with it, which was really nice to see. Obviously, like, that one was, um, more recent than every time, I think. Let's move on. Next one, If You Seek Amy, I believe this one is. Yarth. No, I definitely haven't seen this. If. You. Seek. Amy. I know who that bitch is. So. I'm gonna mention him again. I've got a friend that loves Britney. I mentioned him in every fucking Britney video, but he told me prior to filming this that I needed to watch this this um, news broadcast where this woman basically on live television ripped into Britney because if you see Kimmy was being played on radios and like she thought it was really bad for kids and all this fucking bullshit. So that's obviously who this woman is. Fuck her, right? I love it. 
I'm glad I know that. Oh, hi, sis. What you been doing? Oh, there's a panty. She found them. Oh, guys, so far it's a very seedy visual, okay? And I'm liking that, okay? I like a seedy visual. She is a seedy character. I wish we had a bit more lighting. But, I mean, it do obviously it needs to be kind of dark for it to be seedy. But I'm liking this. Ooh. The choreography is kind of different, too. It's very, uh, gyrating. I think this song is genius. Just gonna put it out there. I think it's fucking genius. Look at all... Look, guys, look at all the gyrating everywhere. We've got fucking hands and... Pussy and ass everywhere. And Britney's always in the centre. Okay. Well, what we're doing now. Do you know what this part reminds me of? Do you know in Greece when Frenchie's got her song and it kind of like goes all like really ethereal and beautiful and like blurry? Ooh. This is kind of what that reminded me of with like the whole pink jacket and shit. Okay, Frenchie. Wait, is that supposed to be Amy, right? She's giving me posh totty. Wait, 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 wait. Is this meant to be like a jab at all these people that say that are saying that the song's disgusting, this, that, and the other, and like Britney's so sexual all the time? Because she's gone from like being hypersexual at the very beginning to like this is a very classy, um, all American lady just like walking around. You know what I mean, like really composed. <laughs> Yeah, look, like she's got like, she's an all American lady, husband, nice kids, like the perfect family. Okay. I don't know. Let me know. It's interesting how, like, inside she was like this very seedy character, whatever, and then, like, in the public eye, she's portraying herself that way. Or is she meant to be Amy right now? Do you know, guys, I actually don't know. This has kind of got me thinking once again. Make any sense, does it? I love that they used the um the news broadcast. I love when people do shit like that that take like jabs. I like it a lot. I wonder what that woman thought when she saw this video. I wonder if she watched it. Of course she watched it. She's a fucking Karen, clearly. Guys, anyway, if you see Kami, another great fun video. For me, it's in between every time and womanizer. Um, I'm gonna need some clarification on what the kind of the ending was meant to go with, because I kinda gave you a few options there. I wonder if I'm right with any of those. Maybe not, probably not, let's be honest, it's me, I get everything wrong. But, yeah, let me know about the ending, but I loved the choreography in this one, I thought the choreography was really interesting. We definitely had a lot to chew on in that one, right? Okay, let's just move on, let's keep this, like, good vibes flowing. Next is Break the Ice, and I know that this one's, like, animated, like, this is anime, like, it's that kind of vibe. So, yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> See, they can literally do anything with like anime and stuff, so I wonder how far they went with the story and stuff. Okay, so she's flying. Oh, so we fully got a villain, so like she's playing like a uh, superhero her heroine. Is it heroine or, her or heroine? What am I fucking saying? She's no, she's, you know what I mean. She's a female super superhero. Okay, this is giving me like, I could see this being um. A... Why am I struggling with words? A comic book? For fuck's sake, that took me so long. This gives me very comic, comic book vibes, which I'm liking. Oh, kick his ass, kick his ass. We love a flexible queen, we really do. Oh god, he's got goons! So is there another one of her? Oh, this is... Why... Wait, Loki, why am I loving this? I was coming into this expecting maybe like for this to be my least favourite, just because obviously it's anime. But it's really kind of interesting, I'm kind of getting enthralled, okay. Wait, she's bombing it. Oh dear god. Oh, I'm gonna say, it didn't seem like a good guy. Oh, she got like a poisonous kiss because she's fucked him up. Okay, poisonous kiss. We love that. Absolutely. Get him fucked. Get him fucked up. Wait, but they were all her, no? They were like similar to her. Or were, were they like maybe clones of her they were making? 
Oh, wait. Wait, maybe there's something in here to do with like the industry and shit. Oh, that kind of got interesting for me then. I don't know, I'm probably reaching really far, but I feel like maybe there's something in here to do with the industry. Okay, Miss Britney bitch. Burst. I enjoyed to be continued. Is there another anime? Okay, I enjoyed that one. Yeah, I did, and I want I want expecting to enjoy that enjoy it as much as I did. There was a really nice story there. We might have had something to do with the industry in there too, towards the end. I don't know, maybe that's me just being completely fucking stupid, but please do let me know. But I enjoyed that one. Okay, Break the Ice. I love that song too, guys. It's an absolute banger. Okay, moving on. Next one, Till the World Ends. Let's do this. Okay, I'm excited for this. Oh, we're getting grunge. Wait a fucking minute, guys. Okay, so she looks really fucking good in this one. The outfits they've picked for this one, wow, the colouring as well. This looks like a fucking Marvel movie. Maybe not on the same level, again. Okay? Because I feel like I'm going to get some Marvel stands coming from me. But it seems like that kind of, like, dystopian vibe. I like it, like, apocalypse, like, post-apocalyptic thing. Oh, I'm liking this. And we've got something happening in the sky. Oh, the world's ending. Yeah, everyone get underground. Come on. Okay, okay, okay. So they're giving me very post-apocalyptic. I've already said this, yeah? We're getting underground, underground grungy, grungy, disgusting, like, dirty, like dirty vibes. vibes. Okay, I like it. We're getting very mosh pit, okay? I would like to see them go up. Up to the... I don't know, fuck around up, up where the world's ending. I'd just like to see that. So I'm hoping that's that's where we're gonna eventually get to. We haven't so far though, okay? That's one thing I would like. Like so far we're dancing under the ground and it's a party, okay? The costumes though, wow. Go up, go up then, bitch. Do you know what guys, it's actually giving me very, do you know, does anyone watch The 100? I watched, I watched maybe like the first two seasons of that, I didn't finish it, but it's giving me very that. Oh, I don't know if they're gonna go up and mess around. But I really wish they did. <laughs> oh, okay, so she poked her head up. She poked her head out. Okay, okay, I'll take it. Okay, so I would have loved to see them obviously go up and fuck around. But I do understand the preface of the song as well was let's just keep dancing till the world ends. Okay, I do get it. But I feel like we could have had a really good like big mob of people just like dancing with like bombs going off behind them and around them, like meteors and shit. Like the visuals could have been insane. I would have loved that visual, I can't lie to you. But am I still impressed and do I still like the video? Yes. Now where am I putting it on my ranking so far? Because I, I don't actually remember where I put things. Womanizer was that at the top? Yeah, I think it was. And then we had If You See K Me. And then we had Break the Ice. And then we had Every Time. Till the World End is kind of going just above Break the Ice, just behind If You See K Me, I think. It's kind of very similar to Break the Ice for me. I feel like I liked them both similar amounts, so I could kind of tie them there, to be honest. But, yeah, really nice, really nice video. I'm liking how all these videos have given me something really different. Like, and they've all been pretty good budget. Like, there's not been one where I've been like, God, they really just did this visual to do the visual. Do you know what I mean? Like, they kind of really picked well with the singles and really went balls to the walls with concept and everything, which I really, really appreciate. Last one we're doing is Circus. Now, this is the one that I've been most excited to see because I love the whole concept of the album. I love the album. I think it's one of my favourites from her. I obviously saw little snippets in For The Record, um, the documentary that I watched. So, yeah, let's go. Oh, okay, we've got some product placements. Absolutely. Get that coin. Oh, yeah. Ooh, ooh, I'm liking this little filter thing they've got going on where it's like kind of central, it's obviously in focus, and then like kind of the outsides and the backgrounds are really kind of blurred and like smeared. I kind of like that. Kind of funky, kind of fresh. Okay. I'm excited to see the choreo. Ooh. Yes, bitch, get that leg up. 
Oh yeah, we've got some cane action. I'm liking it. I'm liking it. I like this part for sure, where, there, where all the girls are on the chairs doing fucking whipping and shit. And we've got an audience. I love, I love it. I love this kind of thing. I really bum. Oh. I'm not sure about that shot. That's the only shot I'm not sure on with the hat and like the like see-through number. I think the see-through number works and it's fucking cute. But I don't think the hat goes with it. But I get I understand why they also needed the hat. I don't know. Give me a different coloured hat, maybe. But the angles they've done in this is really interesting. Come on, figure. I do wonder, are these fucking lions real? Because I won't be stood there if they were real. Surely not. Surely they shot this maybe separately and then put her in it. Because fucking hell, look at it growling in the face. I would not be, absolutely not, I would not be stood there. Mm -mm. Let's go. Oh, absolutely. Give me fire. The fucking elephants. Dancing too. <laughs> okay. Love. Love. I love that fucking music video. Everything. Great music video. I loved the whole fucking vibe. As it went on, it just got better and better and better. I feel like they've really built it well. Oh, great one. That's for sure towards the top for me. I think it's kind of tied with Womanizer because I feel like Womanizer really was successful too. They're all really fucking good, aren't they? I'm just looking at the list of the ones that we've just done today. Like, they're all very, very good. Okay, so thoughts. Circus, definitely one of the best. I, c I had a feeling it was going to be. Loki, I kind of had a, I kind of had a thought, kind of had a feeling. That's why I kept it to the end. Okay. Um, just because I do love that whole kind of vibe. Obviously, no animal cruelty. Real life circuses can fuck off, but absolutely not. I mean, absolutely. Right. So where am I placing things? I think probably top womanizer and circus. This kind of proves guys, the circus is that bitch. Because we've got fucking Womanizer and Circus definitely at the top for me. And then we've got like, if you see Kami, did I say? I think I did. And that's like all circus there. And then we've got fucking, um, I think I put like Break the Ice Until the World Ends kind of together too. And then Every Time. I thought Every Time was good. I'm not saying it's a bad music video just because I put it at the end. Absolutely not. It was a really good music video. But it did have me a bit confused where, where what was real, what wasn't, what we're trying to get at here. I liked the jab though at the media and the fucking paparazzi. Great stuff. Okay, but yeah guys, these are my thoughts. This is another six music videos done. Let me know down below what other ones you'd like me to see. Obviously from albums that I've listened to so far. Maybe look at stuff from, what was my last one? Britney, and then whatever one I do next. I think I might be doing Oops, I Did It Again next. But anyway, this does bring us I thought I had sweat patches, but I don't. This does bring us to the end of this video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. If you did, please do like, comment, subscribe. I'd love to have you here. Check me out on Instagram and Twitter. Be on the screen up there as well as link down below. Turn the post notifications on. And yeah, I'll be back soon with another video. Until then, love you guys. Bye. Bye, guys.